Hello everyone, this is Jen with CI Web Group and uh, I wanted to do a quick marketing update for our managed accounts and give you just a couple uh, notes for you to think about. <clears throat> um, and this goes for everybody, everyone, all of our uh, clients that are on our um, either step one marketing plan or SEO plan or social media plan. <clears throat> all right, a couple things. One, uh, I want to remind everybody, quality SEO can only be done um, you know, if you're focused on these three things, one is, are you relevant? That has to do with the labeling of the content on your page. If you are on a, a six-month SEO plan with us, um, just remember, don't change any of the um, title tags, meta tags, descriptions, and so forth on your homepage or in your general settings on your uh, websites. If you change them, then it, it drops our page rank, so that's the first thing. Um, secondly, if you have... Uh, a phrase that you want to get into uh, Google's directory for or a city that you want to get in directories for, remember if you don't have content with that label on your uh, page on your site or multiple pages even better on your site, there's no way for us to optimize for it. So if you want to get found in New York, you've got to have pages about whatever business or services you are or you have in New York City, or in Chicago, or in LA, or in Hollywood, if you want something more specific. So um, I just want to remind you that you guys creating content, sales content, is going to be critical, um, especially if it's geography-based uh, listings and so forth. I also want you to remember that the way people are searching is changing. So when I talk about relevant and how you label content, you have static content, which is typically all of your our services pages or our product pages. But in addition to that, you have an entirely new query that is happening constantly, and that's for mobile searches. So you're going to have consumers that are picking up their tablet or grabbing their mobile device and they're saying, Siri, what's the top five blank in blank? Or what's the best blank? Or Siri. Uh, show me a such and such or Siri and it asks a question so your blog content as far as you posting frequent blog content that is addressing the top 100 questions you get asked from real people all the time is going to be critical for from a labeling standpoint for you to start getting um, found for or maintaining your existing rank um, for things that we're currently doing for you. Next critical is currency. Um, how frequently you're posting new content. If you're on an SEO plan and you're not posting content on a frequent basis, then it's going to be more difficult for us to be able to assist you than if you are posting content. So um, depending on uh, which level of package you guys are on, you're either getting uh, a monthly meeting or a bi-monthly meetings or quarterly meetings and so forth, just make sure that that's one of the topics we're addressing is you know, how frequently are you, are you adding content to your site? We've got to both do our part in order for uh, you to be able to really leverage the, um, the program and, and get maximum results for your time and our time. The third, and right now, one of the most critical factors is, are you trusted? Uh, all of our traditional standard SEO plans, we're now also concentrating on uh, social media. Are you, uh, are, are you socially connected? What's your net promoter score? What's your social equity look like? What's your clout score? Um, we need to be really concentrating on your social positioning and this is going to be critical. So uh, we may be contacting you a lot more and doing a lot more work with your social sites um, because we essentially adding content is not enough anymore. You've got to be uh, also um, very trusted and highly trusted uh, within all the social networks. So how many people you have in your Google Plus circles, making sure your Gmail account uh, is your primary account on all of your blogs and that's what your, uh, your author profile is under making sure that that Gmail account is tied into a Gravatar and it's connected to all your social sites. We really just have to make a particular Gmail account um, the focal point of you as an author and the popularity of you as an author now plays a role in how uh, well your, your site is trusted and ranked. And so I want to make sure everybody's understanding that we're making some pretty significant changes in our business model. We've hired new talent to try and uh, really support you in some of the changes that have taken place. Um, you know, I'm specifically pointing out Google's authorship change in December 2013, uh, which was very recent. Um, so those of you that thought you could just uh, embark on an SEO program and strictly stick to that now really need to be uh, considering what your positioning is in a social environment. Your social media marketing plan, strategy, and execution 
is really having a huge imp impact on your search results where your website's located uh, within the search. All right, next, um, what we're focusing on for many of you right now is helping increase your fan base. Um, if we've got uh, an increased fan base, and we're using our network to build your fan base, um, primarily because we've got to get your edge ranks up. So the first step is we're going to help build your fan base. The next step is we're going to help you increase your edge rank by uh, sharing, liking, commenting, uh, posting across all of your, your uh, uh, fan base sites uh, in order to be able to increase um, your edge rank and your edge rank is going to help you make sure that the content that you do post to your Facebook actually gets seen by your network. Most of you um, that have not been on a social media plan with us, you guys are posting content consistently uh, to a small base of people who like your fan page that actually don't even see the content because you're not meeting those requirements. So I don't want anybody wasting their time. Uh, creating likes, publishing content, and no one's seeing that content because they're not meeting other requirements. So uh, that'll be an area that we concentrate on. Also, we're doing uh, more frequent trainings with um, all of the changes that are happening online. It's critical that you guys stay in training. So if you go to 12steproadmap.com, click on webinar series, please register for uh, trainings. The registration link's on the left-hand side. Um, also, make sure you sign up for our newsletter. We lots of training and content uh, breakout sessions we include in there. And then lastly, uh, we're starting a live radio show, and we'd like to make sure you guys are uh, set up to be interviewed on that. We want to be able to track your success, performance, and so forth. And so uh, there's a link on, on that page that says get interviewed. Go ahead and fill that out, and let's try and get you on the calendar uh, for sometime in the next few months. Um, so exactly what I just said, that we're really concentrated on building your network and improving your edge rank. Building your network and improving your edge rank. Um, you'll notice if you go into, uh, um, let's see here, let me pull up a uh, 12-step roadmap. <clears throat> Let's go to CI for a second. Um, so Ed Rink is going to consist of how many likes do you have, how many people are talking about your site, uh, how many likes you're getting, how many shares and so forth, and how many people. So you'll notice you're going to start to see these things increase drastically. And I'll just give you a couple examples so you get an idea. <clears throat> so as we're posting content, different people, um, this is really has to have a significant amount of engagement on it in order for it to work well. All right, um, <clears throat> so last things, don't forget to register for the uh, webinar series. You can do that here. Um, make sure you check out the breakout sessions, which are on the right-hand side. Um, we're cross-promoting cross your, your pages across each other's pages and uh, leveraging all of the people within our, our um, uh, client base to be able to help you guys build each other's networks. And so um, this is a, a very collaborative marketing strategy to help compress time and accelerate the results that you have online. And um, I can't believe I'm losing my voice, but I think we're good. Uh, a couple other updates. We're building a library of inspirational and motivational quotes. Right now, your guys' content, most of it, um, is too specific to your business, so it's not easy to share that content across other verticals. Um, if you're interested in having us post inspirational and motivable, motivational quotes on your um, page on your behalf, please just shoot us a message and let us know. Also, we recently launched a communications department that is headed up by Tammy Kling, who is VP of Communications. She's incredible. So um, we've got to be able to help you guys with corporate books, white papers, ebooks, blog posts, conversion messaging, website content, social media content, newsletter content, and so forth, uh, reactivation campaign, sales materials. So when it comes to content, um, we've got an incredible, incredible team that can put together that for you. Uh, so if you feel like you don't have enough time and you know content is critical to your success, then definitely give us a ring and let us help with that. Um, next, we have an amazing design team. If you haven't seen our graphics work, please let us know. Um, our design team started six months ago, so uh, if, you, if you possibly were working with us 
um, a year ago and we only had a, a strong development team, you're going to want to re-engage with us and find out what our graphics team can do for you. Um, right now we're helping a lot of clients uh, create a consistent design and graphics branding message across all their social media accounts by creating all their profile images and graphics and so forth. We're helping with creation of call to action uh, logos in addition to custom design work for websites, sliders, uh, rotators, and then also we're standardizing um, people's newsletters for them. Right now a lot of people are not uh, consistent about getting email newsletters out on a regular basis because they don't have a good format. So if we can uh, come up with the graphics and the design work to be able to um, make a real pretty clean format for you, and then you're just plugging in a few blog posts with a read more, get more information here, read the full article, you're going to be in a great position. And then lastly, if you guys have not downloaded our mobile app, you're definitely going to want to do that. Just grab your Android or your iPhone, go to the App Store or Play Store, and uh, search for 12-step roadmap and inside uh, that app you can access our customer support forum, consultation forums, you can access all your training videos, you can see when other trainings are coming up, you can access our radio shows, you can access your own radio shows. Uh, there's a ton of content information on our mobile app. Again, it's 12-step roadmap and um, I think you guys are really, really, really enjoy that. And then if you're interested, of course, then uh, having us make one for you, please let us know. We'd be happy to do that. All right. I've been talking for too long, but I wanted to make sure all of you had an update. So um, you kind of know some of the stuff we're working on. This is just uh, the items that we're doing for everyone um, that's on our marketing plan or our step one uh, marketing plan. So um, there are other things we're working on depending on the customization of your plan and so forth that are outside of this, but we'll touch base with uh, you personally on those items. All right, you guys, thank you so much. If you want more information on uh, how to take advantage of our uh, marketing plan, if you're not on one, you can check it out at 12steproadmap.com.